don't know precisely on that. I don't have an air intake for that piece. I mean, a co-air intake to know what that means. But I do understand that it actually creates a, f- a really ridiculously loud car. And I was kind of wondering, like, what's your guys' opinion on loud cars or, like, having air intake or having mods in your car? Like, I'm, I'm accepting, like, tint on cars. Like, I accept that. I accept wheels, tents, some body kits, not too much. If it's just, it can't be too racy. It just has to be decent enough. Like, it can't just be like a, like a BMW 350i or what's, what a weird body kit. That's even a Y body kit on that thing. And then just like you driving through that garage, you, you're not even looking cool. You're scraping your body kit through the way we're going to work. Yeah, and then driving in traffic well, might be a pain in the nails because your body kit is so large, you can't even sit up to the next lane right. So, <clears throat> just, uh, I really don't know. Or, like, what is it, like, what's that other one called again? Where uh, the tires or the wheels are, like, tilted in a weird angle? Like, what are you guys' opinion on that? It's like, <laughs> it's like one time I was driving home and I seen this dude, he mod his car like crazy. I don't know what what it is. It sounds like a turbo charge in there, some some type of weird turbo in there. Because I heard all I heard was like, phew, choo, like that physically. That's all I heard, like a, choo, like, and it just went right by me. It's like okay, you got a turbo charge in there, and I thought you had like some weird modification because some people just like remove the gasket or try to like cut the gasket down or try to move the entire head union out of the, where the gas like the exhaust is trying to make that extra loud exhaust even though it doesn't add any performance into the exhaust and then make your car even slower i don't know i'm just putting the gas down right now but i'm just saying physically but what do you guys think idea on that physically because I, I was looking at this person that was driving by it was like a nissan 350z and this person was like, it was all tinted. Like, I don't, it feels like the tint was not 35%. It felt like 20% tint. And he has like a 5% tint in the back. And his wheels are like black. I think this is like, it looks like it's like 17 or 18-ish. And then he has a wide body kit too. He has a white car. He has like a carbon fiber hood. It looks nice though. It looks really nice. But then it gets to the point where it slowly don't look nice anymore. Where his front and his rear wheels are like tilted up. So it's like a diagonal. So it's driving the diagonal. So all you're doing, you're not wearing down your middle tire. You're wearing down your side of your tires. And I was like driving a highway and I was like, what? what in the world? And he forded it all the way across my car and was like, Man, I'm I'm kind of curious right now. How many times you bought these tires, anyways? Like, I feel like that's like the twenty seven hundred tire you bought. There's like, cause when you buy a tire and you mod it and you go into a weird corner or just tilt the rims up a bit, you're kind of warning down that f- that piece of the tire versus like having just one tire in the center. And I, I feel, the alignment on that whole car is all off, anyways. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just saying though. I'm just saying. I'm messing around with people right now, but I'm just saying like it's all off though. Like, how can you even drive right? Like, and then talking about like lower cars. Like, I was looking at this person right here. I was driving over the speed bump. My car was easy as nail to drive over the speed bump. So I went whoop whoop. And then some other dude behind me. He has like a low. He doesn't have no body kit. But all he has was like a really low spring where it feels like it's hitting almost like he has only like one inch of clearance over the speed bump. And then all I seen, and there's a car coming out from the other direction, and all I seen him is cutting the, the speed bump at an angle and he got stuck. And when he went to the other side, all you just heard like a scrape under his. Whew, on <laughs> under this entire front to the rear bumper, it was so bad. And also on the sky skirt, on the side skirt, skirts, it was really, really bad. And I, uh, it was so bad. Like all you heard, like that really weird squeak. If you guys wasn't noticed, I really don't know. Like it's a lot of crazy modification right now. But 
I don't know if you guys have ideas in modification cars or modification anything, but modification whatever. If it's like decent enough that actually do something, but I don't like something that goes so crazy over the bat that tilts the car over in a weird direction. And the tint doesn't really make a difference to me because it doesn't really do anything too much. It's just like decreased light coming into your car, but it makes makes it look cool as nails but yeah like i don't really don't understand what's going on right now a lot of modification is going crazy haywire right now so yeah and also with that being said i actually was i was going to like some other store why i wasn't that really going to the store i was going right by a store and i seen this person was working on this car and what happened is this. It's so weird. So you know how physically when it's like nice cars in front of, of an apartment or a nice car in in front of you, driving in front of you, people are also going to be like, going to say something either crowd, no, car plus crowd equal disaster. It, it was physically like that. So physically, he has a, can we try to picture what he has? He has a really nice BMW, like a really nice, like, really nice bmw it's like a white bmw he has a body kit but you can't tell he has a body kit that's how legit it looks he has a nice exhaust i think this is like an elite exhaust system all the way down from the cat back exhaust all the way up to the front of the engine and all you just can physically feel and hear from that it's like a nice roar like a roar sound and all you it was in the parking lot too so you can actually picture it out it was in the parking lot and all you just see is like well, he's not doing donuts, but all you just see him just, like, ranking up his engine. And one person saw it was like, hey, you know what? I can't, I can't wait for when he started ranking on that engine and just blowing up his old engine. <laughs> and I do agree, because, like, it's physically not going to be nice. At least try to do just some donuts right now or do something. But I feel like it's not going to look nice. Oh, man, it was bad. And then the crowd started coming in and... Oh, man, it was terrible. It went from him washing and fixing the car to 